Pickles, you want to you wanna do a little test? This clock's giving me anxiety. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, I thought we were going to do a test, but I guess if you just want to sit and chat about things, we can talk about anxiety. Yeah, you doing okay, buddy? That sounds, How are you doing? That sounds like not very entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I agree with you, but you brought it up, and I want to be respectful of your feelings. I did see, I told, I told a couple of you about this at least, but I yeah. did, did see a, a TikTok the other day that was like, you know, like s someone from Gen Z being like, oh, man, I'm... <laughs> oh, okay, I oh, guess. Sorry. Yeah! That was an accidental uh, firing. That's another uh, glad it went off when Ian yeah, was me around. Too. Yeah, sorry to wildly interrupt there. No, it's fine. Uh, it was just it was uh, someone from Gen Z being like, "Boy, I've just I I've got so much anxiety. How did how did you deal with this?" And then it, and then it's a millennial going, "We didn't know what it was called." <laughs> oh God! Oh. It's like, we just oh. we just updated our status to something to something dire. <laughs> yeah. Remember when you just update your status and is blank? Mm. And every now and then it'll come up in your Facebook memory feed. And 12 years ago, Jordan Hopkins wrote a post, is feeling sad. Mm. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know that feeling because I went through my entire Facebook post history and deleted everything uh, that I did. Oh my god. <laughs> I should do that. Oh yeah, song lyrics on MSN Messenger, oh, your yeah. aim a away message. Sight so tweeting your crush and your aim away message. Oh, yeah. <laughs> God, God, I love the uh, the auto updater for the aim message. 